Hi, so today's video is going to be on how I put in my hair extensions and everything. Someone requested the video and I was like, yeah, I'll totally do it. I'm just going to give you a couple tips before I start. Basically, extensions to me, like I've been, I've been wearing extensions for a really long time, so all this is like really common knowledge to me, but when I first started, they did not look good at all. So I might as well like give you some tips that I've learned over time and stuff. So yeah. For anything, always brush your extensions from the bottom to the top. Sometimes I do admit that I get a little bit lazy and I'll go from the top to the bottom. Not good. Start from the bottom. For taking care of hair extensions, treat it like your own hair. Give it heat protectant, condition it often if it ever starts to get naughty. It's probably because you're not like taking care of it. Really treat it like your own hair and you want to be very gentle. All these hair extensions are already cut and everything, so they might look like they have a little bit less hair. But if you are scared to cut your own hair extensions, please go to a salon and just have them put it in for you and cut it right there rather than just cutting yourself at home and being like really worried about it. And you trust them and everything, I believe that you would be perfectly fine. But if you trust yourself with cutting your own hair at home, you probably just would do it at home anyway, so. It goes from small, large, to small, and then you put in the loose pieces that are like the single clips. So this is what goes on bottom, like on the very bottom right here, and this is the piece that goes right above it. So it'd be like that. See, this one's a three piece, this one's a four piece, this one has a lot more hair on it. And you probably notice that these pieces aren't really like blended or anything that's because I put all the length on the bottom and the top pieces is what will blend the hair because the bottom pieces don't really matter too much these two pieces are my length pieces this is what makes it look like my hair is long let me just go ahead and brush this out <laughs> next piece I would put on top of that four clip is another four clip as you can tell this one's blended out a little bit more right here on the sides it's chipped down a little and on this side also and I always cut my hair when it's like actually in, like when I'm wearing it. And then this is the piece that goes on top of this one. So as you notice, it's from going from four again to three. So it's gonna go three, four, four, three, okay? And this is the final piece that I would really put on my head. Uh, this one is blended a lot. In case you haven't noticed, my hair is pretty short. So putting in hair extensions is a little bit more of a challenge for me so I do blend the final piece a lot because this is what's going to overlap everything so if you think about it the more that this is blended the better your hair is going to look inside the back I always try to blend it a lot too but I try to keep some length but I do try to blend the back just a little bit more because um, when it's laying down in the back you don't want like a you want it more blended sometimes I do get lazy and I forget to like <laughs> actually fix my hair properly and do it but if I want to look good, then I guess I try. <laughs> Single pieces, it's a little bit different. These two right here are my length pieces. As you can tell, they're tapered only in on one side, right here and here. And then the length is right here. So half of it's short, half of it's long. Basically what that does, I put those right here, and that makes it look like the bottom of my hair is actually long. So you don't have these little short pieces peeking out. And I feel like that's a really, really important thing to to notice and do. And I have two more pieces and these are actually the pieces that are going to be blending this part of my head. The side right here on the top. As you can tell they're quite choppy right here and then they have little strands that kind of blend them off just a little bit. Like legit this is like two strands of hair right here. Um, but it does help a lot. It'll blend it and it'll actually be like sort of the length of my hair but just a little bit longer. So it really, really does help to have these pieces also. Those are all the clips that I have. I believe that they're 22 inches. Well, you know all those tips, these are VP fashion. I do have a code, boop, right here. Um, so you can totally go order them and you will actually get a discount. And the code has been there for a while. So I know some people already have gotten their discounts and stuff like that. I'm just showing you how like fast it is that I do my hair. Um, first things first, I always straighten my hair. And yeah, if you wanna know how I do like the feathery look i already have a video on that next step i actually just use a hair clip and brush and i just section it um i do under the ear kind of like right around here section it off my bra is like making me look pretty good today hmm. that's not what this video is about that's not really cut or anything go ahead and put it in and I always do like, I don't know, I think it's simple, I'm just like a little pin. And then 
the sides also. I don't tease my hair at all when I put in my hair extensions just because I know how to clip them in. Um, next piece goes up here. Um, I don't feel like you need to tease your hair and not only that, but it's extremely bad for your hair. So I recommend not teasing it at all. <laughs> next length piece, the four piece. I'm going to put the two clips right here on the sides, or on the kind of on the sides, and then this one's going to go there, in the clip. There's no like waves or wrinkles when you're putting it on your head. Next one is going to be more like on the temple. Like, if it is wrinkling or something and your head's too small for the length, you can grab it, but go straight and then go down, and it'll give you more space to like pull and play with the like, hair extensions, that way it's not like wrinkling on you or anything. Then get the blending piece of the four clip, put it in, like how you did with the other four clip. Then this one I actually put pretty high on like the crown, but I make sure that there's enough hair to hide in the back. Sometimes my mistakes do show though, but whatever. <laughs> then you have like the really, really blended piece. Go ahead and put that on. So these are basically cut the same. It doesn't really matter what side I put on my head. It doesn't have to be perfect because even if you like angle them, it's going to give it like the, the lengths, like the blending, it's going to give it like different directions. So it doesn't really matter if you put it straight sideways or anything. Um, I do play with my hair extensions a lot. Like if I ever put them up in ponytails, it's like a circle formation. So they're like upside down, sideways and stuff like that. So don't be afraid to like angle your hair extensions as long as it's covered. It's totally cool. Um, but don't be afraid to like play with the angles with the hair extensions. And it looks pretty good. Except for these short little pieces right here. You see right here where it's like... That's like the first sign of being like, Jesus, we're getting hair extensions! I don't really give a fuck if people know, but... Um, I mean, if you're gonna do it, you might as well try, right? So I put the short side on the inside right here, so it does blend it out. Um, so we're just going to pin that, and short side on the inside right here. the bangs. I like feathering it out for this hairstyle, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and I'll be right back. Okay, and that's all I do for my hair sentence, and I apply my ears. Um, these ears are from Kitten Signings, because I know I'm gonna get that question, but uh, they're the Kiwi Line ears. Yay! Um, they do it, the, they do the release like once a month. So this is really it. That's all I do. Um, I will sometimes go like this. And then that will get me a lot of length. This fucking t-shirt gives me no room to breathe. I swear to God I'm gonna die. Just looking long hair on the front. Um, so that's all for today's video. I hope it helped you. Um, once again, the code for everything like VP Fashion is down below. I hope it helped. And I hope you guys have an amazing day and an amazing week. And I love you guys so much. Okay, see you next time. Bye! Meow.